The deficit push-up is an excellent way to develop the pecs, anterior delts, and triceps, but there's one main point of performance that most people miss inside of this exercise. So I want to make sure I address that so anyone who happens to see this video can ultimately optimize this exercise and get the most out of every single rep. So to start, I'm using dumbbell heads to create my deficit, but the principles remain the same if you'd rather use you know, a stack of bumper plates or parallettes or blocks etc etc whatever else you have at your disposal to create a deficit so let's go ahead and jump in the starting position is very similar uh, to our standard push-up with the exception of this platform that we're using but shoulders on top of the elbows on top of the wrists and I always want to think about squeezing the quads and glutes to really stay as tight as possible through my midline from there, we're descending in the same way, except the thing that makes the deficit push-up unique is that we're trying to get, to our, get ourselves to a place where we're feeling a stretch sensation through our pecs and deltoids. So again, at the bottom of the rep, we should feel a nice stretch sensation, and then we come up. If you're not getting that stretch sensation through the pecs and shoulders, you're probably not going deep enough and maybe that's because you're not concentrating on it or you haven't really mastered the push-up yet, which is also okay. Um, but again, that's what makes this exercise unique is that at the bottom of every single rep, you're getting this stretched sensation. So when you're doing this inside of your workout, make sure you're hitting that. Um, otherwise, you're not gonna be you know, milking this for everything that it's worth. So just keep that in mind and uh, have fun with this exercise and have fun implementing it in your fitness practice.